Welcome to the QuickBooks University. This is Matt Holtquist. Hey, I wanted to put together a video here to show you how to enter and track your mileage. Uh, so if you are billing your mileage to a customer or if you are entering mileage uh, to get reimbursed um, or you're entering employees mileage that you're going to bill to a customer, whatever the case may be. Okay. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go up to the list drop down menu. Okay, and you're going to go to customer and vendor profile lists and you're going to see over here a vehicle list. All right, so you want to add your vehicle to this list or the vehicle that you're tracking. Okay, so we're going to go down here. We're going to click on new and let's say that this is a 2017 Ford F-150. Okay, you can put in a description, but you don't have to. Okay, we're going to click OK, and now this shows up on our list. All right. Okay, so now let's go back to the home screen over here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go to the uh, company drop down menu. You'll see right here. And if you go down to enter vehicle mileage. All right. So what you're going to do is you're going to choose the vehicle. So let's say this was the 2017 Ford F-150. You're going to put in the trip start and end date. Uh, you're going to put in the, you can put in the odometer start and end, or you can just put in the total mileage. Uh, so let's say it was total mileage. And let's say that we're going to build this to Christy Abercrombie family room. Okay. And the item, you're going to have an item uh, set up for mileage that you're going to bill to Christy. Okay, so this is how this will show up on the invoice. Uh, we're not class tracking, so we're not going to use a class. This is billable, so we're going to leave this checked. And then we're going to say, uh, we're going to put in a description here, a note. So round trip to Hickory, North Carolina for furniture. Okay. All right. And that's it. So we enter that and we say, there's the mileage. Okay. So now you can go and you can invoice this to Christy Abercrombie. Uh, so if we just, uh, just to show you as an example, if we say invoice for time and expenses, click okay. And we're going to see that, uh, we should have mileage in here for Christy Abercrombie right here. Okay. For the family room. All right. So we can bill that. And uh, so you click on here, you can create an invoice and it's got some other time and some other mileage in there. But you'll see here is our uh, 150 miles uh, at 36 and a half cents, which is a little low, but uh, that's billing $54.75. All right, so that'll do it. Just a quick, uh, quick lesson on entering that mileage and entering a vehicle so you can track that and making sure that you're billing to the, your customers appropriately. Head on over to QuickBooks University uh, where we show you pretty much everything you need to know about QuickBooks, uh, get you up and running. Uh, and uh, so you can start using reports in your business, tracking things correctly and using your reports to make good business decisions because that's what it's all about. All right, we'll see you over there. It's qbuniversity.org.